we have forgotten the true meaning of nostalgia. We have forgotten that nostalgia is not only a matter of time, but also the feelings that it evokes, the nostalgic feeling itself. Some people argue that you cannot feel nostalgia for something that is less than 10 or 20 years old, in some cases even a longer time, but that's not necessarily true. Nostalgia is not about times that have passed, it's about what you can remember from said times, how you feel things were a little better. Having a global pandemic above my head has made me realize that I am nostalgic for things that happened about 9 or 10 years ago, but also from events that occurred in 2019 or 2020. One of the best ways for me to explain this to you is through music. In my personal Spotify account, I have several playlists. Two of those are I could have enjoyed being a kid a little more and I turn 18 but I'm still a kid. Let's see what I mean with each one of them. I could have enjoyed being a kid a little more. Songs that make me nostalgic about the times when I was still in primary school and my transition to being a teenager and an adult. I feel nostalgic when I listen to those songs because I remember when nothing really mattered that much. It was a time when I watched some shows like Sick and Luther, Hannah Montana, The Wizards of Waverly Place or Good Luck Charlie. Songs like Hurricane by Bridget Mandler or Odio por Amor by Juanes. You know, there are also another songs from the 70s and 80s and 90s like Geronimo's Cadillac by Modern Talking and Designed by Ace of Bass because that was the music that my mom listened to and so I miss that. I miss those December afternoons when I sat in front of the TV as I played on my PS2 or outside with my brother and neighbors or when I was talking about dumb things and making a lot of conversation with my friends sitting on the floor at high school. Life was good, but I had to move on and grow, and I'm still that same kid on the inside, but I have a whole life to go through in front of me. I have responsibilities now, but I'll never stop being funny and happy as I am, I hope so. I'm always working on that. And that is nostalgia in the sense we usually mean. Things that happened more than 5 or 10 years ago. But what about the other type of nostalgia? The one we feel for things that happened a couple years ago or even months ago. I turned 18 but I'm still a kid. Picture this. I was 18. I started working at my first school center, Sykes. The job was terrible, but I met a lot of new people and made a lot of friends. I started paying a lot of my things, like my phone bill and some of my food. I started helping out my mom and stepfather with other bills and whatnot. Some of the songs in this playlist were released between 2017 and 2020. Some of them were not, but I enjoyed them because they were new to me at the time I discovered them. Tracks like How Does It Feel by M22 and Hayley May, or Cheating by Nathan Doe and Malika, but also like Plastic Love from Maria Takeuchi or Lamento Boliviano by Los Enanitos Verdes. Those were the songs that I constantly listened to when I was on my way to work or on my way back home, also when it was time to sleep or while I took a shower. Some of them are the ones I played at El Soup and the ones who remind me when I sat outside talking to my friends about the other DJs that were playing that night and the tracks we chose. It even reminds me of the smell coming from the smokes that my friends were having. Even if I dislike the odor, I miss the moments because they were fun. Really having to make space in my agenda to see my friends, to go out for a beer and a slice of pizza or a burger. Those times were about one or two years ago, but COVID has been responsible for making life harder and worse than before. Maybe one or two years ago I complained about a lot of things, but I have more to complain about now. And past times seemed to be better. Maybe they were just okay or kinda good, but God, would they feel amazing right now. Those activities we missed from before. You get it now? That recent nostalgia, 
even if it was one or two years ago, is what I am talking about. And we have forgotten that nostalgia is not only about time. In fact, time is just a little part of nostalgia. Most of it are the feelings and sensations we experience, and time is just the cherry on top of the cake. I turned 18, but I'm still a kid, you know? I miss those times. Maybe they were better or just okay. Like, I, I, I feel like I could have enjoyed being a kid a little more. And people told me not to complain about things that I have or that I don't have and to be grateful with God and, and life and what I have done for myself. And I am. But, uh,. Andy on the office one time said, you know, I wish there was a way to know you're on the good old times before you've actually left them. And crap, that hit me. I felt that. Bonus clip. Anemoya. Nostalgia for something you never experienced. Have you ever felt nostalgic when listening to Vaporwave or Outrun? Or maybe when listening to old Japanese city pop or looking at pictures from the 1920s? Maybe a more contemporary example, the song California by Phantom Planet and theme song from the TV show The OC. Why, why do you miss California if you'd never lived there or even like <laughs> been there before? feeling nostalgic for something you never experienced yourself. Either it is because you have never been in that place or you were not alive at the moment. And that's it for today. Thanks for reading me. Follow the playlist on Spotify if you would like and I will actually link all the playlists that I have made recently on my official website blacksong.jimdosite.com so if you want to hang out there with me and send me a question or ask me something in private or whatever you want head over blacksong.jimdosite.com I'll be right there and you can see some of my information and book me if you want me to play at your party here in Costa Rica or <laughs> well maybe outside I don't know um, thanks for watching Never stop dreaming, keep dancing and have a nice night.